Jocelyn Foster has always been a healthy, fit young woman. So when she was diagnosed with type 1 diabetes at the age of 32, it came as quite a shock. That was just devastating for me. Uh, I really didn't know, you know, what to do from there. Before I was diagnosed, I was very passionate about my running. Um, I ran five marathons, um, over two dozen half marathons. They told me right off the bat that I was going to have to change the way I was living my life. With a little research, Jocelyn discovered that in fact many high performing athletes were also type 1 diabetic. So needless to say, I found myself a new medical team who are totally supportive of everything that I do. And since being diagnosed, I've participated in seven triathlons and actually just registered for a half Ironman next year. She also found hope by participating in the Halloween Howl an annual run set up by the Diabetes Foundation to help raise funds and awareness. We're trying to raise funds so that we can better manage the disease and ultimately cure it. We have amazing researchers here. We take steps to fund their research as quickly as we can, and that's why um, we're raising money for this run. The colorfully attired event is accessible to families and kids as well as competitive runners. It is a great family run where you don't typically get that for competitive runs. So you don't have to be in prime shape to do this run. You can do the 3K walk, and it's around the university grounds. It's a lot of fun. Um, but if you want something a little harder and a little more competitive, you can also do the 10K run. Of course, those who have diabetes must take precautions to manage their disease, but it doesn't have to slow them down, especially at an event like this one. For Shaw TV, I'm Jen McDonald.